all right guys all right guys how are you doing you're welcome to my tutorial again so this is how you can make use of a send blaster send blaster to you know to send your email it is very easy to use it's a software that you can use to send thousands of emails to your you know to your to, to your subscriber so let me launch the the application the thing is this one is a is a is a is a light is a full-time license version but also you know cracked so you might want to off your antivirus first before you install it you have to first off your antivirus you know after you off your antivirus then you can install it after you install it don't launch it yet you should also what then go to the crack folder crack it with your key gen then you can now is no launch your software to make use of it it's a very very nice software you can always use also and and, and i'm telling you though I, you know i sell it at the lower prices if you want it you can get it from me so this is how it actually works it's very very you know easy to make use of so it's loading it's loading okay you can see it's it's up it has opened right now you can see it's a pro edition you can always follow my 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 key my mouse key is a pro edition simple as a pro edition so you don't need your tip so thank you so uh, it's, a, it's a prediction like i said you need to off your antivirus before you can get this one to use that is if you didn't get the premium version from the seller so you get it for me you have to put off your antivirus launch it use the key gen to crack it then you can now you know install it use the key gen to crack it then you can now launch it so it will now open for you because if you did not off your antivirus your antivirus will detect the key gen as a virus and will not be able to you know to work on it so that's the first thing you need to do so the next thing you by the time this window open the first place you go to is your list and addresses your list and addresses go to manage list when you go to manage you see a lot of lists here okay you see a lot of lists you see i have just two lists here i have just two lists brain spine spencer and my power and so so you have to create a a new a new list for yourself so you can just create uh, so you click the red the green button that new one you click it and then you now type the list you want let me just write test list one test list one you understand so that's my new list so by the time you type that you now go straight to import just go straight to import you go and import the email that you want to be on that you know on that uh, list so you click the import on external file external test because that's where we are going then after the list and subscribe to new addresses you then you click on your import you understand click on import so you go to where your where your file is by clicking this those three but those three dots so i've already created one that's test one 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 so i just upload it then i click next so i come here again just you know just click on the first one and just click on next it has imported everything so you just click ok it has imported the 017 you know email on that list into our new you know, list so you just go to manage list again so from there you can see our test list as as 19 as a 17 email on it now that we can make use of so after you've done that one so what you need to do is to go to your message then go to compose message and when you go to get to compose message you see a lot of a lot of these things you know this one you can do your html on this one this one's for html why this one's your plain test you understand so uh, i don't really have a <clears throat> i don't really have a much of uh, these uh um html so let us just go straight to to use plain test let us plain test understand but first of all you put your subjects how are you how are you today so i'm going to i'm going to in the place i say hi i am friend i am peace Can I get to meet you just for friendship? You understand? So let me just leave it like that. That's a friendship. So let me just leave it like that. So you can go to spam check to see to see how you know to see your spam score to see you know how much of the spam score it could be. It could give you. You understand? So it's calculating the spam score. It's calculating the spam score. And uh, said it's okay, it's okay. So you 
can go ahead the spam score is okay so which means most of your emails are going to deliver it. so the spam score is okay so just click okay so the next thing after you have typed this one you have put this one there you know you need to send your message what you are sending your messages to you just go to oh, send so when you go to send you now click on the list you want you know i have taken this now i have this one i have this one i have this one test list so i've written test list one 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 so let's go to test list one 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 so all my lists all my email address on that list are, are now are now here so that's where they are going to go to so my email address this is the email address i want to use to send so i could uh i could use another email address you understand i could type it there and put it there you know um, no, I put it there. But so, whichever email address you want to use, fine, use it. But the one I want to use is already this one. So I'm going to put it there. The same address I'm going to get reply to. The same address I'm going to get a bounce back to, which is here. It's also the same. So and the name of the oh, email, it is immaculate peace. But I don't want to use. But let me just put peace, peace Janet. You understand? Peace Janet. So that's the name of the sender. Then you come to this place which is your SMTP. You put your, you know, I'm using Gmail SMTP. So with the Gmail SMTP of that email address is what I'm using. So I put my SMTP here. I put my, you know, the username, which is the you know, the name of the, the email, the email address, the name of the email address, as the email address, then the password. You see, in this in this situation, in this situation, you have to be very careful because the email address you want to use must have a two-step verification, you know. Must have, you must have, must have, you must have enabled the two-step um, authentication on that Google account of that Gmail. You must have done that so that it will be easy for you because the password they are going to give you will be different from the password you are going to that you use to open your Gmail address. And by the time you open your two-step authentication password, then you they will, you know you now link your you now add your software to the gmail they now give you an email and they, they, they will now give you a password that you can use alongside with the gmail which is this one that i placed on my gmail here now so if i test it you will see that it will go oh so so far not found Sorry, I think uh, sorry, I think uh, I'm, I'm not on. <laughs> I did not. Hope, I don't put on my internet. So let me just quickly let's let's go and look for the internet. Let's go and look for the internet. So I think that's that's where the issue is. So that's why it says. Uh, so so I hope you understand it to all this level that I said here. Yeah. So the you put the port four six five. You put the SMTP server of that email address, you put the username of that email address, you put it there, and the password that it gives to you, not your normal password that you use for your email address, so uh, you put it here, and then let me see whether the, okay, now we are not, we are not connected, so let us, let us test it, so it's connecting, you see, it's connecting, it's connecting, it's connecting, okay. that's the connection established, that's to tell you that we are good to go, so the next thing you do is to go straight to your send, so you can just click on send immediately. So since we, we already have uh, the compose matches, the compose matches say, how are you today? Let me put I. I. How are you today? So the compose subject is there. The, the, the plain test is there. You understand? Then uh, from that. So let's just, I and please, can I get to meet you? So that one's simple. So the next thing, just go straight to our send. And uh, you just want to just click on send. When, by the time you click on send, you see connecting 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 see one has gone two has gone it's already sending it's already sending the mail you can see five email has gone has been sent six email has been gone you see it's going it's going it's going it has been sent if you want to abort it you can abort it and it will stop but i'm not aborting it so let it continue 13 has been sent 14 has been sent 15 has been sent now the whole email has been sent you can see that is just it so okay we are okay with it so that is just now that is how this oh, software works you can see that it's very fast and it's very easy now let me go and check one of the email address that is was on the 
that was on that list. Let me see whether that's, whether my my uh, let me see whether my 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 mail actually delivered. Okay, this is this this email. So I'm gonna check on this mail. It's actually my email. So let me go and check whether I did the email that I sent actually get delivered on that stuff. So let's go. You see, please, Janet. You see, it's there, right? Let me let me let me refresh it so that I can see. You see, it's already refreshed. Please, Janet, how are you today? So let's see. Hi, I am Peace. Can I get to meet you just for friendship? Do you see? It delivers straight into the inbox. So this is how this uh, this software actually works. It's very, you know, a nice one. So you endeavor to get it. I sell it at a very cheaper price. You know, it's a it's a, it's 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 a it's a, it's a full time license, and it works as premium. You understand? You will enjoy it when you get it from me. It's just thank you. You understand? So if you need it, just contact me on my email address, and you know, or we talk, or just put your or put your comments. On the, search, on the comment section and we can talk more about it. So come here again, do have a wonderful time. Thank you and bye for now.